Today I want to talk about behavior. The company must establish a code of conduct that, among other things, ensure the respect between professionals, regardless of their level within the company. This code shall also extend to other people and professionals outside the company that relate to it customers, suppliers, partners. Do not tolerate foul to this code of conduct. Exemplarily punished code faults, including the lack of respect, and make sure the organization knows it and stand firm in professional relationships. Values such as integrity, honesty and respect are no borders to cross. Act and behave like a role model. If you want respect, you have to start respecting you. This includes talk to others as you want to talk to you dress appropriately for the occasion some people may feel uncomfortable if you are out of tune beyond time. Respect the time of others. Raise your voice or shout to others not to be cynical or sarcastic and hurtful to others. 3. Keep your word. If you promise something, stick to it. This will give you credibility, reliability, and will project that you are a person that can be trusted. And this is a matter of respect and credibility. Get very clear expectations. Learn to say no effectively. Learn to say yes effectively. Learn to effective request form. Do not let me cry, nyingani nor disrespect stop having the conversation if this happens. Defining clearly that this way of talking is not acceptable and that the reason you give for the conversation is finished for this reason. Ignore the people who nyingani you. If you're not important to them, they should not be for you. Ignore these people will help you create a magnetic attraction. If someone disrespects you so very clear, do not lose your cool. You can react in three ways, saying that this is unacceptable directly in front of everyone. And end the conversation immediately. Returning to the same coin. Although not recommended, it is sometimes necessary to show strength, impact and consequences. Separate and clearly say that if this is his way of approaching you is intolerable and I will never have to do again. Use your talents. If you are a smart person manages situations. If you have ease of labia, sarcastically counters if you have a sense of humor, and make jokes about you take away important. Take it like a joke and laugh at yourself, fitting the blow with humor and laugh then also that you lack of respect, so you know he also expects this next time. May. Introduce properly have your presentation studied avoid arrogance and pride, but not be overly humble or belittle you. Ask someone of high reputation like this the introduction by a sponsor with high credibility you better position if you present someone with little credibility or respectability. Create your professional and personal brand. Define how you want to perceive other people. Then construct an image in that direction, behave accordingly in plans of the person you want to be. Be consistent. Be good at what you do and what you promise in your professional brand the expertise earns respect. Becoming an expert is an arduous task. Be humble, and side up. Let others sing your talents and avoid do it. Word of mouth works. You cannot claim to be a teacher in something, without being an expert or at least have a high level on this issue. I earn it.
If you are not an expert on any of the issues you deal or you're talking about, it's okay to admit it. Differentiate that of which you are an expert and what you're not going to encourage you to establish your credibility as an expert in your area. Let your actions events, actions, articles, words, tweets, classes, seminars, etc. Speak for you and positioned at the right level of expertise through word of mouth. Skillfully uses ethically but the level of power or, or empowerment you have decisiveness organization priority what and who spend time to perform and ask favors. Today I want to talk about behavior. Shows Connect Network and you're online. People connected with lower risk of being missed respect. When someone disrespects another is taking a risk. The risk is that the other would return later, saying bad or explaining the type of person or professional is. Therefore, the stronger your network will have more guarantees to be respected. Therefore, use LinkedIn to build.